we lived in the project which had 96 apartments. Since uh, most apartments were shared by two or three families, that meant about 200 families. And there were three Jewish families in that project, ourselves and two others. Uh, that was a period of uh, extreme anti-anti-Semitic propaganda. I mean, where anti-Semitism was a crime, and uh, it was really punished. It was not just on the books. And I remember one incident in our courtyard or in our project where the local drunkard called a woman uh, Zhidovka, which is the Russian for kike. Uh, obviously, you know what that means. And uh, she wasn't Jewish, but she brought charges against him for anti-Semitism. Now, in Russia, they had what they called Tavarsky Sud, and there's a comradely court, which was the court of the, within the project, which settled family disputes or between the families, any, any local things uh, to keep it from the real justice system. So there was a trial, and uh, he was found guilty, and the judge who was one of the local residents, found him, fined him five rubles. And he was very incensed about it, and he called the uh, judge a uh, kike lover, a Jew lover. And now it was already an offense against authority, and he was sentenced for three months in jail by a higher court. And most of the people in the house uh, I don't know whether it was because they got rid of the local drunk or whether it was, but uh, uh, I never experienced any uh, anti-Semitism, or at least not visible 